Man. Man. One turn. Hello, I'm Neil, and unbelievably, this is day 18 of the Tightwad Dad vlog. This is my experiment to find joy and happiness in all of the money that's leaving our family every day by sharing that spending with you publicly on video every day for a month. I'm now 18 days in, and uh, so that's about halfway through the month. I'm worried these videos are boring. But if we don't spend much, then hopefully these videos will be short. So here's all the spending we've done today. I'll try to add photos where I can. Add a little bit of music. Oh, that's, that's better, yeah. So, the first thing we spent on was Pilates. Not me, uh, but Joy 10, I'm assuming. Also, I wasn't there, but we spent in a big chain supermarket in another town. Uh, we got stuff, so that's a Joy of 10. What else? Oh yeah. Filled the car up with fuel. Uh, these pictures are getting slightly literal, uh, but it's the best I can do. Joy, they're 10, obviously. Don't want to be destroying the planet, but equally, it's good to be able to take the kids to school. Oh, and I forgot there were swimming lessons as well. How was the swimming lessons, Joy? 10, yeah. So last night we were talking about how much chocolate I eat, because everyone's seen how much I ate when I was working away from home and then my long-suffering wife explained to the kids that she had a chocolate bar every day when she went to work and then we realized why she might have had a Mars bar every day just already so I'm this far in with the vlogging and I can see now that everything we do and say will look bad in the future. My family have already started seeing some of the vlogs I recorded earlier in Manchester and I was trying to explain to them that the reason I'm doing this is that I'm not a good role model and that's why I'm sharing it with the world. I am not someone to to copy. Worse than that, I think everything we say and do online will look bad in the future. Everything, literally everything we're doing will just look unacceptable at some stage in the future. So if you're watching this now in the future, please don't judge me. I'm trying to do my best, but, and, and it, clearly it's not good enough. But know this, literally everything we do now will look awful sometime from now. It might be three years, it might be next week, I don't know. And, and, and luckily my long-suffering wife actually tr tried to help me out by explaining to the kids that that she, when she first started work, she would eat a Mars bar every day. And they were, my kids were shocked. So I showed them what life was like for us when we were younger. <laughs> 50 years of Mars goodness, and now we bring you the biggest Mars bar ever. Even more milk, more glucose, more sugar, and more thick, thick chocolate in a bar that's bigger than ever before. Tremendous value, really satisfying. The biggest Mars bar ever. They were like this. 50 years of Mars goodness, and now we bring you the biggest Mars bar ever. <laughs> Mars goodness. More glucose, more sugar, and more thick, thick chocolate. Glucose and sugar. In a bar that's bigger than ever before. Tremendous value. Really satisfying. Mars goodness. <laughs> and that is why Daddy has boobs.
Can you please help my daddy get 1,000 subscribers? Just click on his face. Thanks. Bye. How was that? Really satisfying. More glucose. Oh, and uh, thanks for uh, any thumbs up.